what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel uh as always thank you to all of the returning subscribers uh, i appreciate you guys being here with me all the time um and if you're new make sure you hit that subscribe button uh today we've got something totally different for you guys um come with me let me show you what's going on before we get started too deep here um so if you see here it looks as though we have some type of uh animal here uh digging holes in my yard um i had a i had a oh jesus get out of here anyways um i had a the local pest guys come over and um we have a gopher problem uh if you guys couldn't tell um he told me that um i could trap them myself or i could pay them to do it for 90 dollars a month and it's not guaranteed um so he showed me the type of trap to get um mccabe traps uh i bought them online on amazon for 11 bucks i think so i, I bought two so i spent 22 dollars uh, i got them in the i got them in the hole here you can see that uh i'll pull it out here in a second to show you guys what it looks like um but uh because it's classified as a non-game mammal here in california you can trap them on your own uh, without a trapping license so that's what we're doing um we're gonna try to get this little bugger uh because he's tearing a mess into all of look at this look at these plants uh he's left that one alone uh he's got this one here he's got a little burrow in here um so yeah so he said the guy that we talked to said um they're coming here because they eat the roots uh, they have access to water because there's a sprinkler system for the plants so um he's getting uh, everything he needs from our plants here he got um he got this plant this year that's where this thing is at the, now and then he got this plant uh last year uh he got this plant last year um so we are going to try to get rid of this thing uh once and for all like i said he told me what to use as far as traps i've never done this before i just watched youtube videos online um really it, uh, a lot of the videos said to like search where the tunnels he's going at but um i'm really not i mean i shouldn't say i'm not in into it like doing it like that but uh, I'm going to try it myself and do it this way and see what happens, like I said. Um, I'm fairly certain with this one right here, he's going that way to that plant over here. Uh, where this one is, uh, I mean, I don't know where the hell he's going with that one. But, um, yeah, like I said, we're going to try to get this thing. Hope you guys like this video. Um, make sure you hit that like button. Um, hopefully we can get this thing. Uh, let me take out this trap right here and I'll show you guys what it looks like. Um, like I said, it's, I'll get sprung real quick so I can show you guys how, how I got it set up. Uh, this is, like I said, a McCabe trap. Um, let's see if we can find my camera stand. So essentially what you do is, let's see if I can do this one-handed without... These things are very, very sharp, so be careful. Um, as with, you know, trying to trap any any animal. Make sure you guys are being careful. So what you're gonna do is push these two down. There's like a little a little tab right here. Let's see if I can get in there. Look at see that tab right there. That'll go over this little this little ring. Uh, this straight piece will go into this bracket, and that'll sit just like that. And then when the, the little rodent, when the little gopher comes and pushes that back, it'll come up and go like that to him and we'll get him. Um, I obviously can't do this one-handed, so I'm not even going to try. I don't want to um, get myself sprung. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to get this thing set. I'll, let me, let's come over here. I'll, I'll show you what this hole looks like. Um, I got another one over here. The one that's in that hole right there and that thing goes back a ways and the tunnel is huge um here's what this little tunnel here looks like i know you guys can't see it very well but um 
it goes in there quite a bit uh like i said i'm gonna get this thing back in there hopefully we can get this thing today or tomorrow and uh you guys can see what that looks like but like i said i checked online i talked to the, the pest guy the rodent guy it is completely legal for you to do this in california by legal means traps like this um it's a non game mammal so you're allowed to do that don't worry about it um i need to get rid of this thing so i'm gonna, I'm gonna get this thing set and uh put it back in the hole and uh hopefully we can get this thing um i can if i need more traps i'm gonna go to the hardware store there's a couple other ones i'm gonna try if these two don't work um we'll try it out but uh yeah hopefully i can get something for you guys and i'll talk to you in a minute all right so all right, so we got the thing in there. So I did want to go over to, um, I got this little piece of wire on here. Uh, the guy that I talked to that came to the house and told us about it suggested putting that wire on there so that when, I mean, you can see where where the trap is set out so that um, when you, if you end up catching whatever you're trying to catch, um, you can just easily pull it out with the, with the wire attached like that. So hopefully we can get this thing and it doesn't go too far in there. Um, but yeah, so it's in, uh, got this one set in here pretty good. Like I said, I got this one set in here. I might push this one a little bit further in. Um, yeah, it goes, it goes in there a ways. Uh, like I said, hopefully we can get this, this thing. And uh, like I said, I'll keep you guys informed, obviously. But stay tuned, and we'll see you guys and however long it takes to get this thing. All right, guys. So it's only been a couple hours. Um, I actually, the trap was sprung when I went to work. And I couldn't go and do it at the time because I was rushing out the door. I was already late. So I just want to make a disclaimer right now. If you get queasy about stuff or if you don't want to see um, an animal in a trap um, click out of the video right now we're gonna go take a look at it right now um, it, it was not even what an hour and maybe 10 minutes after I set the first trap that we had one um, it looks like um, it dug out one of the one of the other trap the other trap that I put in there and then kind of like screwed its way over to the one that I actually got so let's go take a look at it all right so here it is here's the first one uh, I mean, it's nothing, nothing special. Look at the little, little <laughs> things we got here. Um, yeah, so we got the, we got the first one. Looks got like, him right on the side of the face. There he is. He's a goner. Got him. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get, get him taken care of. Uh, we'll get this trap set again. I don't know how many are here, so we'll get this one set again. Uh, I'm gonna try redigging that one out because it doesn't, it, it didn't spring, but it doesn't look as good as this one did. So we'll get these reset and then I'll talk to you guys again tomorrow morning. What's going on, everybody? It's the next morning. Um, we didn't get any, any other action last night uh, or this morning yet. Um, I talked to the, uh, the pest guy. He said to stick the, the gopher back into the hole that I caught it in and close everything up. So I'm going to do that um, to the hole that I caught him in. And I'm going to try setting this other trap into a different bush. But uh, yeah, so that's, I mean, we caught it uh, pretty quickly. I got the uh, the trap back in there. So I'm going to have to take that one out and stick the bullet back away. And I'll put another trap here. And I'm going to put that trap where the gopher is right now into this hole. Um, I don't think we're going to get another one. I think that was the only one, which is crazy because, I mean, if you look at that, that little gopher, it caused all this problem. But, yeah, so I hope you guys liked the video. Uh, if you have any questions about how, I mean, like I said, all I did was just stick a trap into the most likely areas I thought he was going to go into. And then that was it. I mean, uh, there wasn't really anything special to it or about it. I just stuck it in there and, you know couple hours we had one so uh, if you have any questions um make sure you guys put those down in the comments uh i will put a link to the trap that i used down in the description uh so if you guys need to use that um 
yeah i hope you guys like it something different uh i didn't expect anything out of this but uh, i mean uh, in a couple hours we caught the little little rodent the pesky little bugger that we were having issues with so hopefully we we don't have any other issues with any more gophers here but if we do we know how to solve it so uh, make sure you hit that like button make sure you subscribe if you haven't already and uh you know duck season's coming to a close uh, we went on a guided hunt this past Friday, and I wish I had been able to film that for you guys, but the guide had asked respectfully that I didn't do that because um, it's his business. He didn't want us. He didn't want people knowing where his area was. But, and I get it, but it's kind of disappointing. But, um, anyways, yeah, I hope you guys like it, and until next time, see you.